So welcome ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, episode 26 of Master League, got a big match coming up today, that's right, we're taking on first place, Real Madrid, not that it really matters too much because we're so far behind them, but if we win it helps Barcelona and Atletico Madrid out, so yeah, look forward to that, and then after that we've got uh, Ibar, 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 ding dong, uh, and then we're back into the Europa League in the next episode, now before we dive into this, of course, the big news is Italy and England have both reached the final. Unbelievable. I mean, that's just a dream for myself. Why? Because I'm both. My mum's English, my dad's Italian. So it's a win-win anyway, whatever happens. However, there is one team I will support a little bit more. I'm going to talk about that when I put out a video. I'm going to be doing uh, an England-Italy final Euro 2020 video. Probably be out tomorrow on Saturday. I'm literally going to sit there, I'm going to quickly go through the matches, put side on like one minute, and I'm going to get it in England both to the final, and that way I'll be proper. We're going to have the cup and all that, and we'll get a winner. Uh, and it should be a little bit of fun, but that way I can talk to you guys about that. Why do I support this team more than that team? And doodly doodly. I've already kind of mentioned who I favour more. Um, you know, but you guys will find out even more when we uh, whip out the video, so stay tuned. Anyway, today, taking on the Real Madrid, we've decided, or Luigi himself has tactically decided to copy um, Zinedine Zidane's side here, right? So 4-3-3, that's what we're going to be going for. The form's already... See, the form isn't great, really, is it? Uh, apart from, you know, Iromendi on full form, Yathabal, still don't know how you say his name, I, I listen to everyone trying to pronounce his name in the Euros, and, and to me, all I'm getting is... Da, da, da. That, that's literally... I, I, it doesn't even sound anything like this. I mean, to me, that's Ayarzarbal. Now, I know it's different in Spanish, but all I'm getting from the commentators is... is da, da, da. I mean, that, that doesn't mean anything. So, yeah, I think Ayarzarbal just sounds better. Anyway, him, Anuachu, and Luigi today... Try and use the wings when we can. We're going to play false wingers, all right? So that should get Weiser and Tavares forward to whip the balls in. Uh, and look for the big man. Luigi's going to be on the right. Uh, and then David Silva, Marino, and Ilaro Mendy. I mean, he's still got Yanis. I like to play a little bit more. I know Baron had a really good game the last match against AC Milan, but I don't think he's, he's quite there yet to take on the Real Madrid. So that's what we're going to be going for. Real Madrid looked pretty solid. A lot of quality in their team. Uh, they've gone for the Benzema, Hazard, Rodrigo up top. Uh, Sergio Ramos, obviously, no longer there. But this is last season, so technically he is still there. Anyway, I hope you guys do enjoy this one. I will see you there at the Santiago Bernabeu. Simple as that. So without further ado, let's dive into this. Hopefully it's a whopper. It's time. Let's go. Ooh. Look at that stadium. Oh, look at the atmosphere. It's very orangey. The sunset is uh, setting. But this is a big match. A big match, probably more for Real Madrid than ourselves, just to keep first in the table. But have a listen to that atmosphere. Ooh. Very, uh, it's very loud in here, isn't it? I know the referee's whistle is loud. I do know. But the thing is, I've had to crank up the audio of in-game to get the uh, the net sounds better. So that that kind of makes the whistles louder and everything else louder. So you kind of have to take the good with the bad. Uh, anyway, here we go. Let's get this going, boys, and really play well today. But it, it's going to be a tough match, no doubt about it. We're going to have to try and contain this, uh, this Real Madrid side early on here with uh, Marcelo to Modric. Looking for... Oh, Hazard there. Could have gone down. Um, wasn't meant to quite do that, but that's fine because I know Archie's there first. Um, and I'll tell you what, there's a massive gaping hole here for uh, Marino. I don't know where on earth Real Madrid's gone. Marino lays it back. Uh, I was looking for Yadamal there. Uh, if Marino had a little bit more pace, you know, then it's job done, isn't it? But unlucky as Weiser cuts back floats it high, it's a bit of a whopper towards the back post it's a lively start to the game this, Rodrigo yeah we'll see how this false wingers works for us see what happens, and here Rodrigo looking for cutting Benzema it's a good header there Luka Modric towards uh, Ian Hazard watch the run there of Modric folks 
Well, you're not having that with Marino lurking about. And he lays this one up the line towards Luigi. First time ball, he's in. This is the chance. It's Anawacho! Oh, he struck it well, didn't he? Well, it's been a lively start for us. We need to maintain this. Right, Anawachu, no question that you've got to win this header. Flick it back post. There's the ball! I need to try and flick it away from the goalie, though. Can't be keep flicking it to Mendy as uh, who's got stuck in the goal there? Varane? We you doing, Varane? I know there's a speculation that Man United are looking to snap up Rafael Varane. Also, Man United trying to pick up Camavinga. Uh, players that I would definitely not say no to. He's a bright and young, uh, you know, up-and-coming player. Luigi gets caught there, but no foul. Benzema. All right, this is where the problems can lie, though, for Real Madrid, as they can quickly just counter out of nothing. But they are playing very, very attacking here, Real Madrid. I'll tell you what, Anawachi's done absolutely brilliantly there. He's fed that one off, and it's going to be a good challenge by Ramos. I wanted the volley. Yeah, I can, I can definitely see some goals in this game if it continues this way. Real Madrid are just going for it. Benzema, watch the run of Benzema again. No, watch the run of uh, Rodrigo now. And um, we haven't watched the run of him. Diop, stay with him. Just back to Andrea Zola. Inside to Tony Kroos. It's a good bit of play by Real Madrid, and I thought that was in the bottom corner. Ooh, it's difficult. It's difficult to contain them. You know, they've got a lot of movement in the middle. Heen Hazard cut in from the, uh, cutting in from the flanks. And, yeah, that's, that's not far away. And Awachi doesn't even have to jump. Doesn't even have to jump. The other about. And Awachi once more looking for David Silva. Who's done, uh, well, exceptionally well. And Luigi, why are you falling on the turf, son? Well, let's have another go then as the ball's fired in. Oh, blimey, we've got some drama going on here. in the opening 17 minutes. It's a lively, lively one. But Luigi had a chance then. I don't know why he felt the need to fall on his big, fat, juicy bum. Around to Sergio Ramos. Casemiro now comes off uh, Yadabal. Oh, not a great pass there again by Ramos this time. And now Yadabal has got some space and time. It's going to be the big man. Oh, he took too long. He took too long. Ooh, got to shoot fractions away Tony Kroos Benzema yeah we definitely we definitely can beat Real Madrid here come on lads keep going with the momentum Luigi feeds it off Vice we just need players flooding forward and that's the ball we're looking for it's Luigi oh he couldn't quite beat him Marino Raf yeah we'll take the foul Maybe this is our best chance because we just we get in there, we just not quite get in there, you know. And I mean, is that a foul? You know, who knows? It's like the England penalty. A lot of people saying it wasn't a foul. I mean, Sterling went down, no doubt about it. I mean, it was minimal contact. I think it's harsh either way, isn't it? If you're if you're an England fan, you want the penalty. If you're a Denmark fan, you get the same penalty. You're going to say it's a penalty, aren't you? So. Yes, anyway, let's uh, let's not mess about with this. This has to go in. It has to be the one and only. It's going to be Luigi, and it's pathetic. Next. Okay, so we've mixed it up. We have gone back to our, our diamond, the old trusted diamond formation. We are going to confuse... Um, oh, what a pass that is. What an absolute pass. It would have been an absolute belter, wouldn't it, if Tavares was listening to me. Yeah, but yeah, we're going to go back diamond and uh, play attacking fullbacks, get players forward. I think this is going to be a different second half, though. I think Real Madrid are going to create more this half. Normally, when they don't do anything in the first half, well, that's ridiculous, isn't it? What on earth are you two doing there? And now the ref's going to give a foul for it. Not a whole lot you can do with that, folks. That's uncontrollable. Um, I don't really know what Marino was thinking there literally just came off his face while he was playing with himself so now he's given a foul away well this is a chance isn't it I mean do we just move the goalie uh, well we nearly did that's alright Anuachu can win that header flick that one on right away we go Marino looking for Luigi flick that one over the top to Yadabao who uh, he, he may not have the strength here but he will have the pace and he might better stay with him. Ah, that's good defending by Rafael Varane there. Managed to uh, keep pace with him. 
Williams. The ball swung round towards Isco. Crows. Isco once more looking for the back sticks. A lovely pass to Eden Hazard. And the first time volley was on. And if that had got in, blimey. That's a contender, isn't it? Goal of the month. We still need to do the goal of the month, by the way. I know I need to get that sorted. I don't think there's been too many submissions, though. And I think that's the hard part. I know Archie. Don't really want you there, mate, to be honest. So we're going to have to do this ourselves. There it is. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, so close. Isn't it Anuachi, though, you know, like, yeah, we'll just run next to him. Use your brain. And yeah, it's not a bad header. It's a tough header. It's not a bad header. Unlucky son. Yeah, we've also changed captains, by the way. I forgot about that because I was going to take David Silver off initially. But then I decided to um, keep him on for the time being. You know, here is Hazard. Trying to take on Weiser. He's not gonna he's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. You can't play around with him that long and think it's gonna work. And that's the ball we're looking for. Right, and Oarchu's one on one. Can he finish? Absolutely he can! Woo! And that's what happens. Ramos is getting older. He gets caught. And the big man who's been on song lately. Six goals in his last well. Last three matches, really. Last three appearances. But this is a great pass from Weiser. He's miles on side because Varane's playing him on side. Takes one big touch, another touch. And what about that for a finish? I mean, come on. Beautiful. So, the heavens have opened. Have they? Apparently, they have. It's absolutely bucketing down out here. Although, to be fair, that looks more like snow than anything else. But, yeah, that's not going to help the cause. I mean, we are pretty much playing all the matches now uh, in the afternoon um, because, you know, they don't really play any matches in the Liga. But already conditions making it difficult. So we'll make our first change. I'm going to take off David Silva. I just need a little bit more defensive-minded players. So there we go. Anyway, better play from Real Madrid. who really haven't clicked into gear too much this match. But uh, here's a chance for Luka Modric. Needs to deliver it, but we're just going to try and stay with him. And we have missed it! Ooh, well, that was either a goal or a free kick. Uh, luckily, it wasn't a goal, but the foul has been committed on uh, Marcilio. Yeah, he did well here. No, sorry, this was Modric, not Marcelo. Yeah, just caught him. I mean, it's a foul. Can't really complain too much. So a chance for... Tony Crows to fire it in. Well done, Diop. That's quality. We'll take that on the touch. Oh, it was a good strike there by Casemiro. Oh, Marino. Ref, he caught me there more than anything else. I love Marino. The guy never stops working. And it's, it's you know, that's what you want to see in a player. As the ball's fired near post. Who's that? Who is that? What's your name, mate? That's a bit of a, a default face, isn't it? I've no idea who that was. Uh, it wasn't Rodrigo. But yeah, free header, and you've got to do better than that, mate. That's a shocker. All right, final two changes. We're going to bring on Yanazai uh, and Daldia on the right-hand side. Well, this is a chance. Tony Crows had one earlier. Didn't really get it over the wall. Let's see what he can do this time. Doesn't happen again. I guess you just have to press triangle, and it, and it works a lot easier. All right, we're going to launch this, and it's a foot race between Luigi and Ramos. Ramos is going to get there comfortably, but Mendy hoofs it clear. Adriazola, can he keep it alive? Yes, he can. Skips past uh, Tavares, does very well there. Tony Crows. Adriazola, Crows. Isco, no, don't let him whip it in. Don't let him whip it in. You have let him whip it in, lads. You're looking shaky. And Ilaramendi says enough is enough. God, these conditions are a nightmare. Really is some pretty torrential. Uh, it doesn't look like rain, though, does it? It looks more like sleet kind of coming down. And there's been hardly any chances this second half. And we're going to nod that all the way back to uh, Moya. And we can start the ball rolling again. Daldia. He's got the freshest legs. He's just come on. Well, Luigi hasn't got fresh legs, but we'll still find him. And now we'll flick it with the reverse ball. That's the one. Drill it towards that near post. Oh, everyone missed it. Drizola's going to get there. I know Anoachu's now knackered as well. God, this game has really gone down to an absolute grandma pace. Crows swings it round to Isco. Tavares, stay with him. Brilliant. Great defending. 
Dupe finding uh, Dubamendi. Space here for Yazabout. He can flick it on. Yanazai. Luigi's on a run and he's on side here. Oh, ref, ref, ref. Well, what's he going to do here? And it's a yellow. Okay. I mean, it could have been a red. I mean, it would have been, it would have been harsh. And I would have had Luigi take this with a knuckle shot. But now he's injured. Unbelievable. And I don't have anyone else to bring on. Yeah, I mean, he got a little bit of the ball here, didn't he? We had to go through the man to get that ball. So, you know, it's six of one, half a dozen of the other. Right, well, it is a long way out. And honestly, I can't see there being a point of striking this. So I'm just going to play it square. Here we go. We're going to dupe them all out. Lay it to Illa Mendy, and we're going to work this round the other flank. Because if anything, we can at least try and find the big man of Anawachu. There he is. Oh, how's he missed the header? Great defending, though, to deny the finish. Well, it hasn't. I thought there'd be more goals in this. I, I, I thought there'd be more goals. Today's. It's been a bit of a weird match. We've still got three minutes of stoppage time here. So maybe one final chance here for Real Madrid. Need to win it. Nope. Yanazai's missed that. And uh, that'll do nicely. Right, get that one forward, Luigi. Flicks it up the line. Anawachu's not there. Lads, why are, we, why are we doing this to ourselves? Chance to play it through. Isco. He'll want to shoot this. Tony Crows. And another foul for Real Madrid. Well, they've decided to play the short one. Is it going to be wise? It might be. A chance now for Isco to deliver. And he has to deliver it now. Get it off him. Oh, he's lost it. There you go. And we're just going to smash that away. And the referee blows for full time. That is a big result, folks. I mean, it is, as I say, it wasn't pretty. A very ugly, ugly match, to be honest. And I thought Real Madrid were poor. Quite poor today. Luckily, we, we played them on a, on a bad day for themselves. There's the shot count. And they had seven attempts to four. Really? We only had four attempts. Hmm. Well, we definitely felt like we had the better of the chances. Man of the match today, the big man. And I watch you. So the other results, uh, Celta de Vigo drew. Uh, Barcelona will now go top of the table. Well, uh, were they second or third? No, I think they will. Uh, Alaves did win. Granada beating Osasuna. Uh, Real Betis losing again. Valencia did win 4-2. Uh, Villarreal dropped points. So did Sevilla. And Atletico Madrid winning as well. So Real Madrid are going to drop down now to third place. We're going to have a three-point gap. Uh, over fifth place at Villarreal and we close the gap on Real Madrid now to what 17 points <laughs> we're getting closer yeah, ridiculous way 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 too far out but hey if I hadn't started on legend I think this will be a different playthrough uh, legend obviously kicked my backside at the beginning of it bottom of the table Celta de Vigo and Levante and someone else anyway we're now going to dive into oh yes the Copa del Rey semi-finals that is the, the cup that we're looking to win. So, how are the lads going to be performing? A streak of Real Sociedad wins. Uh, the team's doing great at the moment. I really feel we're all pulling in the right or same direction. And uh, who will make it to the final? Well, we'll have to see in a minute. So, Porto has fully recovered. Negotiations for Martin Zubamendi. And Anawachu has uh, completed his development. He is now competent in the goals, goals poach and playing style. All right, so we've changed up his style there just a little bit. All right, so today, oh, look at this. Oh, ho, ho. this is going to be a good game, surely. Look at the form. Oh, I love to see traffic lights flashing away and the form looking sexy as you like. All right, I'll pick a lineup and be right back. All right, so as I said, the form today, absolute, probably the best form we've had all season. Um, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven players on absolute top form. If they don't perform today, then I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah, I, I thought I'd try this formation out. It's almost, uh, I don't really know what formation that is. But basically, we're just going to have two AMFs. Why not? For a bit of fun. David Silver in the hole there with Ilar Mendy as the usual DMF. Uh, he's really the only player not up for it, but I need, you know, a proper anchor man in there. Not too concerned. I think we should win comfortably. You know, you would expect that, but we will bring on Anuachu later. I was contemplating these two because they both have the super sub trait. So we could bring him on later, but I'm thinking they're both on full blue. Don't you Just put them in the team. So there you go. Uh, and then we will go from there. So that's that. 
All right, there's a look at the uh, wayside. Four, five, one. Yeah, we, we should be able to contain them. I, I can't remember who's playing in the other match. Let's have a quick look. Uh, Lugar is against Barcelona. So you would expect a Barcelona final, wouldn't you, against ourselves? Fingers crossed, if it all goes to plan. Uh, if we do score early, we know what will happen. Ibar will go mental. Uh, Ibar, Ibar, whatever you want to call them. And uh, they'll just go for it. So, yeah, I think we may have to... Uh, what's Kitso looking like here? Let's have a quick gander. Sorry, one sec, folks. One sec, folks, while we sort this out. So, number seven. Let's see. We've got this one. They all look pretty much the same to me. Let me give them all white. More white. White with the white with the blue. Nah, that's pretty much it, isn't it? Oh, they got black kit. All right, beautiful. Magic. All right, that'll do nicely. All righty. I will see you guys there. Let's do this. So here we are, the semi-final, the first semi-final we've ever got to with Real Sociedad. Uh, and hopefully it will be the first final that we manage to get to. But before we do that, let's wind ourselves up. Go on, you Luigi. All right, that's enough. That's enough motivation for today. As the referee signals, and away we go. Now, if the lads don't feel like, you know, ridiculously good today, then I'm going to be a little bit worried. Because they should be. They should be on fine form. Uh, as we do have an early chance here for Luigi to show his magic ref. Didn't catch him, apparently. I mean, it's honestly might be a better game than the Real Madrid match. Because that was just... It was an interesting game, wasn't it? I said, they never really uh, clicked into gear, Real Madrid, and... They were quite poor. His uh, vice, uh, it's too much dribbling, mate. Can't do that there. Diop, don't get pulled out of position too much. But, uh, swing this around the left-hand side. Got to deliver it. Tries to. Deflection. Cote. It's done well there. Riccio. Well done, David Silva. And we're going to bomb this one up the line there to the Italian. And Luigi... Uh... I knew what I wanted to do. I, I saw Izek. I saw him calling for it. I had uh, an inclination that he may have wanted the pass, but we just got it wrong. As uh, Alex Garcia comes forward. Oh, that's a good effort from long range. And, well, Romero looked a little bit worried there for a moment, didn't he? But luckily, he wasn't. And let's just launch this one out to uh, a Yadabao. Well done, mate. Quality play there up towards Luigi, but he's not hes not awake. Unbelievable. Fed through the mixer. Garcia. Oh, looking for the back stick. Oh, it's a good save, and Romero needs two bites at it. And Yeah, we may even have to stop playing two AMFs. I was that confident about today, and might not be wise. David Silva. Whoa, what are you doing, mate? Calm it down. Miller Mendy lets it run through the old legs. The other bout. Right, Luigi, where do you want it? You want it there? That'll do. Steal it. Beautiful. This is the chance. Well, we're not passing this. We're doing this ourselves. It's Luigi! Woo! We have to have a woo after every goal. Compilation of the woos, but... Hey, lovely. Well, we, we haven't started off the best. Yeah, we've got a little bit, little bit of good fortune here with the defender who takes this touch right there and it kind of slowed the ball down for us we steal it and the Italian just does the rest and, and he scores like he loves to do well what's that what's what's going on today with the weather I don't understand it's it's snowing again huh is there a leak in the roof can't believe it it's an interesting one isn't it anyway we've gone for a 4-3-3 now I've switched it up uh, I think and actually I think a 4-3-3 might be the better choice to be fair because we've got poor two on full form today Likewise, Luigi and all that. So, yeah, we're going to go for the 4-3-3 now. And, uh, yeah, hopefully create as... Uh, well, Munoz is doing this himself. Lovely play. Ref, right on the edge of the box, that. Could have been... Uh, I don't think he would have given a penalty, to be honest. It was inside the box, but... Hey, you can apologise all you want. Yeah, it is snowing, isn't it? That's definitely snow. It's not rain. But, yeah, good play by Munoz. Just took his time here and uh, can't really see because the cameraman is atrocious at his job. 
Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> ah, what a plonker. I pressed circle. I, I wasn't even meant. I was meant to go back. Oh, well, that was a waste, wasn't it? Fantastic. All right, well, we don't have uh, an Awachi for this, so we'll go for uh, Diop. He's missed that anyway. Come on, poor two. Well done. It's the old flip flap. Good feet. And Silver back to poor two once more. I'll tell you what, poor two might do this himself. Look at this. What about this for a run? It's absolutely blistering by poor two. He's still going. He's still going here. He's still going. Oh, this is unbelievable. Finish it off. <laughs> He's still going. Poor two's best run of the season. But uh, no uh, no luck in the end. Right, Weiser. I have to cut that one back. Play that one to David Silva. Who says he's going to have an attempt. Mm. We've crossed the 25-minute mark. And we have the goal that could put us through to the Copa del Rey final. There's still a lot of time to spare. That's a fantastic pass to pour two. Feed that inside. Let it run through. Let's change to Luigi, man. Oh, that's what I wanted. I wanted the ball to go through his ex legs for Luigi to line up an absolute pile driver. And then look what happened. David Silva, Weiser. All right, David Silva wants it now. That's the ball. That's the ball. But it's not the ball. Here's Diop. The other Diop. Fed through the middle. And that's uh, a wasted pass. Well, the, you know, once again, the weather's ruined it. You know, every time the snow comes down, which two days in a row now, which is madness, it slows the game right down. Right, there's the ball through the hole. Lovely pass. Luigi's on side. What can he do? That's going to be the big question. Oh, it's a good save by the goalie. Ah, he, he fell on his bum, didn't he? Just about to hit that. Oh, that was heading in. It was good goalkeeping. I think 2-0 and uh, we just push on for another one in the second half. A yad about Isaac, Luigi, lovely play. Porter 2, Isaac, it was all too good. Oh, that was a chance. The one twos were on there and they were looking a little bit sexy. Camilo. And that's going to be half time. It'll be nice if the rain or the, or the snow stopped. I know it starts in, in Pez, but there's no actual way to make it start, then stop, then start, then stop. You know what I mean? That'd be cool. Anyway, second half. Let's go. Weiser. Well done. He's got so much pace, Weiser. They get you out of trouble. Honestly, that's why you need a pacey winger. Or not, or not winger, but a pacey fullback. Because, yeah, of course, having someone with pace is going <sighs> to... Not a good pass there. But, yeah, save you some trouble. No, watch the, watch the run. There it is, Cote. He's going to cut back. Weiser trying to stay with him. Half a shot, but nothing too uh, crazy. But now we do have a chance to counter. And the more this game goes on, the more it favours us. Is that, you want that? Ah, I saw him and then I just took too long. Decision making's been a bit pants so far, hasn't it? Fed up the light. Sergi Enrich with a chance here. Oh, Diop's missed it, but Munoz was paying attention. And there's a volley. Oh, blimey. That wasn't a bad effort. Well, we've got to pick this up, boys. Been a bit of a bit of a scare at the start of this second half. Well, who's that to, huh? Bob the Builder. Terrible ball. Come on, lads, wake up. Mm, David Silva. We might even bring on Marino. I feel like I miss him in the middle. And I think having Yadabao and David Silva together, I mean, they're both very attacking and it's kind of the way we're playing. But I'll tell you what, great defending there by them. They've let that run straight through. And now you've got Porto Isaac and he's nailed it. Absolutely nailed it. I've got to question the goalkeeping, question the defending. But who cares? Who cares? This is just a long whopper of a ball, straight over the top. I don't know what the defender's doing. Just being a mong hole, really. And lady it square, and his ex says, thank you very much, I'll do the rest. Flicked inside, Garcia. Petro Leon, looking for the switch, but you know, Diop's not gonna, he's not gonna be phased by that. Well, that looked like a two-footed lunge there. And Romendi just scoops it over the top. 
Well, poor two's through the middle here. Good feet by Portu. Lovely pass. It's Vaisa. I'll tell you what, Portu today, I want to keep him on because he's looking better. You know, he's a little bit more. Obviously, he's on full blue. You'd expect good feet from him, but much more nimble than... I think him and Vaisa is a, it's a good partnership. So, we've got 20 minutes left. Two goal cushion. Could all change, though, in the blink of an eye. If the away side can find a way back in this game. Oliveira has gone straight through the old legs, but he does deliver it towards the near post. The ball's flicked on. Norman did just enough to get it out. Here's Diop. Long ball forward. From one Diop to another. Ilaramendi. David Silva scoops it. Yeah, unlucky. Go on, Vice. You want it? I hope you've missed it, because I'm pressing all the wrong buttons here. Pressing all the wrong buttons! There have been a few of those today, haven't there? They've been like that close. I keep thinking it's going to curve in, but luckily it curves away from the goal. And yeah, this isn't a bad effort. That is that is close. Very, very close. And watch it. Well done. David Silva. Come on, Luigi. Go on, Shunt. There you go. Right, and Awachi says, I want it now. And there he is. There's the big man. Yeah, tough header to score from there. He's nearly on the edge of the box, but still, at least he's working for it. I mean, he's now a goal poacher, so we'll have a little bit more emphasis on getting the ball forward. That's a lovely ball straight through the middle. And a fantastic challenge there. And this is a chance and a half, isn't it? Here we go. Luigi's through on goal. Ladies and gentlemen, do we do this ourselves? Yes, we do! Yeah, it's been all too easy today. Three goals to nil. It's amazing, though, the difference, isn't it? Superstar between legend. And this is why we kind of need to find... We need to find a balance between the two. It's just like superstar, it's, it's comfortable to score and win matches. But legend is an absolute mission. Because I just feel like they cheat you out of it. But, you know, I've said that many, many times. Let's not go on about it. Anyway, Luigi did well here. Goalie came out uh, and it was just cool, calm composure. So the final change. We are going to bring on Sangali for a bit of fun and take off David Silva. We don't really need him anymore. We don't really need the team spirit being too crazy. So anyway, here's a chance. If we can lay this up to Anuachu. Oh, we had a chance there, lads, didn't we? We had a chance. Yeah, there could be another goal coming surely. Who knows who's going to get there. Right. Maybe we, we can grab another one. Swing it round. Ah, it's a poor pass, Sangali. Can't really give it away there, mate. Pedro Leon with a chance from distance. And Garcia to swing it in. Can they get some sort of a consolation here? Not with a ball in like that. Far too close to the goalie. And Norman's got other ideas. Well, I'll tell you what. We might even just do it with Norman. <laughs> Go on, Normande! Oh, goalie's coming out! Normande! <laughs> well, why not? Why not score with your centre-back? The goalie's had an absolute nightmare today, hasn't he? And uh, it's just all gone tits up for the away side. But once he was away here, I was like... You know what, let's do this ourselves. Then I saw the goalie coming out and thought, well, let's just lob him from 25 yards and nestles it nicely into the corner. But the referee's going to look at the watch now for one final time as soon as this attack has ended. Go on, Norman, stay with him. Great defending. Oh, that'll do. Yep, that works. And there we go. I said it will be comfortable. It started a bit shaky, but once we got that first goal, then, yeah, it just all opened up and... There we go. We are going to head into our first official final, the Copa del Rey. And we're going to find out who we face in just a second. So there is the shot count. Nine attempts to seven. Yeah, dominated it. Comfortable enough. Man of the match today was Mr. Luigi with the two goals. So there we go. Barcelona said, I'll see your 4-0 and I'll just uh, check. Just checked. No raise, nothing. Just check. 4-0. Wow, blimey. So, we're going to take on Barcelona in the final. And hopefully, it, it's going to be more, more fun than the match we just played. <laughs> I mean, it's fun to score goals, but you still want a bit of a challenge. And, yeah, they just didn't really deliver. Anyway, we're going to return for some more big matches. This is why the second half of the season is so much more fun than the first. Because you've got all the cup competitions going back to back. So, up next is Tottenham Hotspur. 
in the Europa League quarterfinal. And we'll return shortly. The next episode may be after the final of the Euro. So I will see you guys then or before or on the same day. Depends when I get a chance to record. But we will be back with the Euros. Italy versus England in the final game of the week coming shortly. Till next time, let me know what you thought of today's matches. And take care.